hi guys good morning once again welcome to urban media where we do designs and more for you almost every week if you are new here I please you subscribe to this channel and share watch if you also your old camera here please continue watching and update your knowledge thank you very much today we are going to learn how to design a church flyer without my time i do let's get started the size of the flyer is a5 so you come to file then go to new then you come to print here print here then you search for a5 i think a4 a6 a5 a5 is half of a4 so yes so a5 you select the a5 here and this is the uh, you see the the size you can also change the unit if you want to very good let's keep the resolution to 300 yes very good you can double click on it to open or you can click on create here so i'll double click on it to open very good now my my file is ready here now as the document is ready uh, you can see at the top here um, i have my logo here then i have my assembly so what is a it's a flyer designed for a uh, new assemblies of god english church um, now at tepa so if you are around tepa or you are tepa and you want an english church to go please just join this church assemblies of god is a very nice church thank you very much so um i'll bring in my logo here to have my logo here so i'll drag and drop into my project here very good now i will reduce my logo to a reasonable size here as you saw on the flyer so i'll bring it here yeah very good now i have type all my so i have the service of god here i'll copy and paste because of time i can type but because of time to so i'll paste it here very good so now i change my phone to I think it's Arial. nice one here i think this one is Arial. so let me separate this to this one is control cut then i'll I'll click again then I'll paste very good and this font was a uh, I think um, uh, my uh, yes I think this this is the font very good so I'll arrange this one here very good then I'll bring this one to the down here this one down here i'll make sure that this one is too big bigger very good then i can bold it if you can't see the character um, panel you go to the window then you click check on character it will come very good so now it left with my tepa half te no, it does it start to be on cuffs. Oh, sorry. Tepa. Very good. Now, the tepa. I think the front I use was impact. Yes. Very good. I use the impact at the front. So I'll bring the tepa here. Yes. And I won't kiss it small. Very good. Then I'll change the color to change the color to black. Yes, I used black. Very good. And 
for you to make sure that they are all in the they are all centered at the middle you can select all of them including the logo then at the property bar here you click on this one align horizontally centered it will center it for you very nicely very good so you can see there is a paper cut here at the top here for that one i use a mock-up which i downloaded from the internet this is the mock-up too i'll put everything under the description below for you for you to get the files so i'll bring it here hmm. that's it you see that's it so i'll bring it and i'll bring it here very good the mock-up is very very big it has a high resolution so you zoom out or you zoom in then you reduce the the size of the of the paper cut and after that then you rotate it when you're rotating you press on um shift so that it will give you a perfect rotation very good this 180 degrees rotation then we will bring it top here then you you click and you increase the size increase the size here very good make sure that you bring it you bring the this layer under the type very good or under everything so just on top of the background yes you bring in there so that it will not cover then you you, you take it to the top here very good i think this one is okay so i duplicated this one to, uh, i duplicated another one the same paper cut here so nice one i will right click and press on duplicate or you can press ctrl j or you can press on the alt on the keyboard then you can duplicate so i'll right click here and duplicate it here very good then i'll bring the first layer here you know, the copied one the that is on top of the original one so I'll, I'll bring it to the top here as you can see just created another hmm. okay so then after that i i gave this one a, a I gave this one a, a shadow so you come to make sure that the layer one copy is selected then you come to effects and you select um, drop shadow very good now you see the options here now make sure that you you distance it no really yes there's no tab make sure that yes the opacity should be down at least let me cancel it first then let me push this one to the top very good uh, then i'll come to the first drop shadow here very good mm -hmm. let me choose normal again the size will be increase the size small very good i think no i think two is okay very good let me do, let me do the size small uh, and do it 15 15 is okay very good now let me bring it to the down yes yes so that's that's it nice one nice one nice one okay so now uh, as we finish this one let me bring in my background here the main background that i used i used this background i downloaded it from the internet just type on google um dark red um, background design background then you select the one you want so i selected this one i'll bring and drop into my photoshop here uh, yes so i'll make sure i make it bigger this crank it see of shutters a uh, shutter stock very good so as this one is here 
you bring it down here very good or if you want it to position itself here already you have to click here then before you you bring the uh, the image inside and that one to bring it will be on top of the one that it was selected already very good so now let me bring this one down small uh -huh. so to let me lock all of this my background here so that um, it will not everything will not interact with this one so leave it the the picture here um i use the rectangular tool here then i draw a rectangular box here very good so um after that um make sure this one the stroke is it uh, has a make sure the stroke is having no background then the fill that's why there's no nothing inside the fill should be white very good now i'll press and i'll press on um control then i'll bring my cursor here my cursor here then i'll i'll bring it here small very good make sure you press control mm. very good then click ok now my i have a this shape already here so i'll copy it four times very good so i think i told you you have two main ways of copying something the first one you can press on alt here then you duplicate it here very good the second one you can press ctrl j to give you a duplicate here the next one here you can you can press on any of the object here then press uh, you click on uh, where is my duplicate layer then after that you bring it here uh, and make sure that it's having the same interval having the same interval very good nice one you select them all together here all together here very good then after that you make sure all of them is selected then you right click on one of them here then you make the image uh, the shape so now the shape is merged into one very good man now we bring in our picture here this picture i downloaded it from the internet just search google uh, worship people worshiping at church or in church then it will come so i'll just put the image right on top of this um this merge rectangular shape here then i will make sure that the image covers the image cover the shape here this image is in um, clipping uh, it's in a uh, smart object and it is difficult for you to edit so you right click and rasterize this object here very good so after that you click on this um picture here then you create a clipping mask so after creating creating the clipping mask the picture will fall into those shapes for you very good now you can remove the shape or the picture as where you want people to see well i think this one is okay after that make sure you select the worship and this rectangular here you press on after after selecting one this was should be pressed on um control or shift then you select the other one too after that you see this chain here you link it together so that as soon as i move one all of them will move, move together very good you can still unlink it if you want to very good now we are moving on so uh, we are going to type a um, uh, worship with us i think I, I have it here i think i have it here worship with us worship with worship with our copy here then i'll bring it i want to save i don't want the video to be to be too long 
so uh, i have my worship here very good so let me separate the worship from the hour here so i'll cut then i'll paste i'll paste another one here very good now you see my worship is here then i will change the font to come to my character here if you don't see your character you go to windows then you check on character yeah then i'll i'll, I'll i think i use this um great yes i use this uh, great vibes here very good as the worship so i will increase my worship here then position it at exactly where you want it to be very good if it is small you can still increase it then after that you change the color to white change the color to white nice one change the color to white here change the color to white i want to increase it to more very good worship nice one so we have um so i'll change this color with our so with the head of a color picker i can pick the yellow color here from the assumption of god logo then i'll reduce this one i'll reduce this one I'll reduce this sorry i'll reduce this one here okay then i change the the font to arial arial here very good arial here then it's like with uh english church okay then we paste here paste very good now make sure that the english church is bigger bigger so i use this uh, same impact form uh, impact font here for the english church very good then i'll change the color to white color white here very good so i i i i i I embossed it a little bit so make sure that the English church is selected. You go to effect, then you go to bevel and embossment. Very good here. Yeah. Yeah. You bring this angle to the middle here. Please, then you increase. You can also manipulate it to your own standard for you. Yes, then. Uh, then I'll click on OK here. No, I didn't like the embossment here, so I'll double click and go back. what i wanted okay now so the english is church is also you can select this one here and make sure that everything is in this, it's centered correctly very paste it here make sure that the color is um, yellow here then I I 
mission out. The line, each line is too close a bit, so I'll come here, then I'll increase it to 14. I think 14 is okay. Then I'll change the font to change the font Arial. Arial, yes. So now uh, I have I have it here. The church is located at Tepa, opposite the Catholic Church. I just send the the filling station. So if at Tepa and you want a a place to worship as an English don't miss out this and every sunset sunday very good now celebrate my this and every sunday copy now bring it here paste this and every sunday very good then um i'll change the color to white change the color to white then i'll change the I think change this to yes we are almost done we'll be done soon very good so um, the time is from 7 a.m. to 9 45 a.m. so I will duplicate this one here because we are in the same font I'll edit the time. You know, I have the time here. Let me copy it because of time. So I'll paste it here. Time very good. Nice one. From 9 a.m. to bring it down a bit. Then let me reduce this one to 14. Yes, it's okay. Hmm. Now, so we have a quotation or a Bible scripture to inspire you. So, our Bible scripture is here, Matthew chapter 11, verses 28. So, I'll copy it and then I'll bring it here. It's the same font as this the area. So, I'll duplicate it, then I'll paste. Very good. Then I can reduce the font to I think 12. No, I think nice. Okay, then I'll bring the my two down here. I'll, I'll then change the color to color white so that it will be it will to vary from this one. Very good. Now I have I have a rectangular shape at this at the down here, which I I will choose a fill here white. Very good. Then the stroke should be uh, no stroke. Very good. Now, uh, so you can see that um, there is calm and your life will never be the same. It's there. So it's the same font as this one same font idea so i'll copy by pressing on the alt then i'll bring it down here yes i'll then change the color to color black or i'll change the color to i think this i can pick the color from here very good then i'll reduce it to 12 no i think 16 is okay Oh yeah, sixteen is okay. Then I'll type. I don't know whether I typed it. Yes, I have it here. Copy. Copy. Then I'll paste it here. Come, and your life will never be the same. Here. Okay. So as I have my info to here. Yes, that is the pastor's number. Anytime. You, have, you want to ask the pastor something you call him so i'll paste it here so for any info 
then I will change the color to color white. Yes, color white here. Then I'll change the font to Arial. Yes, I increase the size of it to 34. No, let me reduce it. 16, oh, 14. Yes, 14 is okay. Then I'll bring it here. I can still reduce it to more. Yeah, that's the fastest number. So zero two four zero seven two zero six five three. So call him anytime you want to worship with them. Very good. And as you can see, and as you can see, there is a shape here and there. So I'll. So I use this my shape here. I'll bring it inside Photoshop here. Very good. It's already in PNG here. Then I'll bring it into my project here. Very good. Make sure it's small. Then after that, I go to uh, click on OK. And I go to effects. Then I each choose color overlay. Then I'll choose color white. Oh, I think this color is okay. This color is okay. The same way I have uh, this one here. Then I'll bring it to my Photoshop here. Mm, then I'll use this one. It's not in PNG, so it has even a white background. I need only the black. So I'll choose remove all the white background here then i'll bring it inside here inside here very good now i want to i'll go to effects and change the color overlay to the same color or i can even reduce the color small here mm -hmm. In this one is okay okay so guys this is how you design a church flyer this church is a new church at Tepa so you are always welcome to assemblies of God church Tepa the, the new English church please if not subscribe to this channel do all to do so so see you next time bye